Imperial College London, Molecular Sciences Research Hub, MSRH, White City Research and Innovation Campus. Welcome to the new home for chemistry research on Imperial College's White City Campus. One of the top chemistry research facilities in Europe, it was officially opened by the Mayor of London, Sadiq Khan, in April 2019. A £170 million interdisciplinary research centre for research staff, postgraduates, undergraduates and collaborators. Main entrance, reception and atrium. Here in the entrance lobby and atrium, we have a common room with cafe for refreshments. And views up to the research labs and offices. The Agilent Measurement Suite, opened on the 6th of March 2019 by the College President, Professor Alice Gast, and Maria Angeles Diaz, General Manager at Agilent Technologies. This is a collaboration between Imperial College and Agilent Technologies Incorporated. Agilent donated and loaned £4 million of equipment to the Department of Chemistry, an analytical research facility for chemistry research and external collaborations. It is equipped with automated chromatography mass spectrometry systems for analysis and purification of chemical reactions and complex mixtures and for assessment of purity. This is the stairwell leading from the ground floor lobby down to the lecture theatre, NMR and mass spectrometry suites, and laser and fabrication laboratories. Nuclear Magnetic Resonance NMR facility. Located underground in a vibration dampened room on a 1.4 meter thick concrete floor, eight NMR machines, 400 to 600 megahertz, were transported here from the South Kensington campus. NMR uses radio waves and strong magnetic fields in the analysis of molecular structure. Each machine uses a liquid helium called superconducting magnet insulated by liquid nitrogen. This machine has a magnetic field strength 9,400 times stronger than a standard fridge magnet. This analytical facility is specifically for the chemistry research community. B10 Lecture Theatre This is a state-of-the-art lecture theatre equipped with active stereoscopic projection. With a capacity of 242, it is used for undergraduate lectures, seminars and conferences. The Tate Laboratory on Level 3. This is a state-of-the-art multi-purpose laboratory spanning two sides of the building. One of several extensive open-plan lab spaces encouraging collaboration and discussion. This is the Chemical Biology Research Group of Professor Edward Tate. They conduct research at the interface between organic chemistry, molecular biology, and medicine. Cell culture room on level three. This is one of many specialist research areas across the building. A controlled environment for growing cells and tissue culture for biological and drug assays. Center for rapid online analysis of reactions, RAW, on level four. This state-of-the-art facility, opened in 2019, is directed by Professor Mimi He. Equipped with highly sophisticated automated robots for weighing and dispensing of chemicals, it is capable of setting up and running hundreds of chemical reactions. Fast, high-resolution, high-throughput chromatography mass spectrometry analytical systems allow for real-time sampling and analysis of reactions with a high degree of control. Hydrogen gas generator in the raw laboratory the Braddock Laboratory on level six. Another of the state-of-the-art open-plan laboratories with a fantastic view across London. This is the location for the Organic Chemistry Research Group of Professor Chris Braddock. The Braddock Group conducts research in synthesizing natural products and developing new catalytic methods for organic synthesis. Fully equipped with a wide range of synthetic and analytical equipment and extensive bench and fume cupboard space. The College Provost Professor Ian Wormsley on a laboratory tour with Professor Paul Lickis. A student relaxing in the lower lobby. Thank you for watching.